Kalen Patterson, Midwest Muscle. We are here at the Chosen Few in Wisconsin. This show is just off the chain. First fighter that stepped up for P for P, he came off the chain too. Dude, introduce yourself to the people that didn't wasn't watching the show last time. They'll be watching now. Well, I'm Gonzalo Ponce. I'm one of the be best submission artists in the state of Wisconsin, training out of LCCT Baraboo. Uh, this is my fourth straight submission victory, first triangle. Now, the, the guy, he came out ready to go. It's not like you had some some easy pickings. He came out with some energy. I mean, he you know, he gave you a run for your money, but it seemed like when he set that head down, you was all set to take control of it. Yep, I knew right away because I had to fight his teammate. His teammate was my first win that these guys were going to strike at me and I had to protect myself from those. Uh, I was waiting for the kicks the whole time. I'm used to getting kicked in the leg a lot, you know, being the smallest guy in my gym. So I was ready for it, all the striking, everything. I just wanted to make sure I was nice and firm. That way when they hit, I was braced for it. Now, now as a fighter, you know, because there's people that can see, you know, you got the couch side quarterbacks, which was me, and, and Phaedra while we're watching and she's taking pictures. It, it looked like he almost telegraphed that did you see it as quickly as we did, or was that something you just felt on your own? Well, I've been doing this for quite a while now, so everything for me is a feel. As it rolls through, I'm going with it. Um, like I said, though, I knew I knew he was going to have to play a certain game to beat me, okay. and especially with his teammate that I'd already beaten. I knew what to expect as much as he knew what to expect. So I was just waiting and timing it out. Every every kick that was going was me timing and timing and timing, ready to go. Yeah, and then you went on him, and I, I think you really surprised him because he was in, he was almost mid kick when you caught him. Yeah, and you know, like when I've had to fight Rocco, who was also sponsored by P4P. Mm -hmm. uh, when I get when I get my takedown stuff, I am or I'm so my body's so used to being crushed in half mm -hmm. that it's easy for roll under yeah, and still did. get my position. Yeah. For me, it's not a stuff. That's like that's me countering his counter so, okay, so you, and basically, the, you basically roll with the punch yeah and you know the judges aren't going to see it that way but you know one day they're going to one day i'm going to do it enough times that they have no option but to mark that as a point for me and not him okay well I, honestly if you're submitting them like that it really doesn't matter that's true now when, when when you caught him and you could feel it sinking in and he just kept going with what you were asking i mean that had to be a great feeling where you know this fight is going to be first round it, oh yeah, it was a great feeling. And uh, the first thing I was worried about, though, when I sunk it in, it was how much time do I have? Yeah. Every fight I've had I've that's gone past the first round, I was in the middle of submitting the guy, and the timer went off on me. And it's happened to me four times in a row. So I was not going to let it happen again. Well, man, I, <laughs> I'm, I'm like got goosebumps because I was just so happy. We're yelling and screaming. I'm like, I hope I don't ruin the video. But I, can, I, I stayed pretty steady, so you'll actually get to see it and see what you did before the night's over. Good job, man. Thank you. Great job. Anybody you want to give a shout-out to? Uh, yeah, I give a shout-out to Luis Claudio, Thiago Vega, Felipe Barbosa, and Juma Ferreira and for getting me prepared for with my jiu-jitsu for all these years. I mean, it's not every day you walk into a gym in the middle of nowhere and all of a sudden you got world champions coming to you left and right. Yeah. And... I want to thank uh, DJ JB because he mixed up my entrance for me and you know he's been helping me out quite a bit as far as the music and stuff goes. And Wet Night Club for giving me the night off so I can come and party, you know. So I'm going to be partying crazy tonight thanks to them. And I, I know you want to say thanks to P4P. Thank you P4P. <laughs> I want to say thanks to you to P4P too because this, this is an awesome venue, packed house. And that's always got to be a great feeling as a fighter. Yeah, this is an honor for me. All right. Well, thanks a lot, man. Great job. Thank you. Much love. Caleb Patterson, this guy just won his fight. We are out.